For CN2 Politics, I'm Ryan Alessi. Here we are in the summer of 2010, and that means it's time to start looking ahead to 2011. It's the governor's race, and Republicans are trying to find some candidate to take on Democratic incumbent Governor Steve Bashir. Now, a quick word about Governor Bashir. Some new poll numbers have come out, and they show him with a very strong 53% approval rating. But drilling in a little deeper into those numbers shows that only about 12% strongly approve of the job that Governor Bashir is doing. On the flip side, only about 15% strongly disapprove. But that means there's a very large, squishy middle that Republicans say they might be able to siphon some votes away from Governor Bashir with. And the question then becomes, who is the right candidate to do that? Most of the buzz has centered on Senate President David Williams. And David Williams has some very strong advantages. He's a very powerful speaker. He's also a very good retail campaigner, kind of the classic Kentucky gubernatorial candidate. But he's also a polarizing figure in Frankfurt. So it remains to be seen how many people out in Kentucky know of David Williams and what they know of David Williams. Now, not to mention what they think of David Williams. Now, the next step is for a Republican ticket to form, and there has been some rumblings about David Williams in discussions with Kentucky Agriculture Commissioner Richie Farmer. And Richie Farmer, the former basketball player, would be a formidable candidate because of his name recognition. But he hasn't ruled out running for governor himself, nor has he ruled out running for another office, Secretary of State. So that is going to be a fascinating drama to watch. There's also a couple other Republicans being mentioned for running for governor. Bill Johnson, the Todd County businessman. You might remember he ran for U.S. Senate before dropping out of the primary in March. He's looking at the race. Jess Carell, he's a Lincoln County banker. He's looking at the race. He's mostly been involved in Republican politics by raising money for state legislative candidates, particularly those who oppose expanded gambling, which happens to be Governor Bashir's primary issue. And a third Republican being named is Secretary of State Trey Grayson. His supporters would like him to run, but he's just coming off that very difficult Republican primary against Rand Paul in the Senate race. And it would be asking a lot for him to turn back around and run against a very well-funded Democratic incumbent governor. So as the U.S. Senate race unfolds over these coming months, we'll be following that, and we'll also be following this fascinating drama about 2011. So stay with us. For CN2 Politics, I'm Ryan Alessi, and thanks for watching.